Ripple XRP, prepare for the financial reset. It was predicted a long time ago that there will be a financial reset that will replace the current reserve currency, the US dollar, with a new reserve currency. According to experts, that time for the reset is very near, and banks and financial institutions are preparing themselves for this monetary reset. Hey guys, welcome back to Crypto Millionaires, a channel where we give daily updates about XRP. As we have announced a monthly giveaway of 1,000 XRP coins, so hit the like and subscribe button if you haven't already to participate in the giveaway. And don't forget to click the bell icon and share your views in the comments section below. Watch till the end for more chances to win the huge amount of your favorite coin. In today's video, you will know about the monetary reset that is coming soon. You will know that why this reset will come and how will we fight with this. You will also know about different financial institutions preparing for the monetary reset and why XRP is the solution to our problems. So, let's start our video. According to crypto experts, there is a big monetary reset coming. It was predicted a long time ago, and now the time is near. The phrase global monetary reset has several meanings. The standard definition would be a return to global monetary system that all countries would agree to. The last time the countries came together to agree on a new global monetary system was in Bretton Woods, New Hampshire. The theory behind the global currency reset is that the US dollar will lose its position as a reserve currency because the US is overleveraged and less competitive with resource-rich developing countries. After all, the value of currency is a barometer of people's trust in government and its ability to pay debts. If there is no trust, then you have no money. If this happens, it will upset the balance of a system that has been in existence for over a century. As the dollar gained strength due to its former gold standard and Americans' efforts to buy coins after both world wars. In this 21st century, the money will also be digital. The digitalization became more common because of the COVID-19 pandemic. Now, as predicted by the experts, the monetary reset is near, which will replace the dollar with digital currency. There are many proofs that show the reset is near. Bank of America has become the latest major bank to make a foray into the cryptocurrency sector. According to an internal memo, the bank has created a team dedicated to researching cryptocurrencies. The Bank of America believes that it is uniquely positioned to provide thought leadership on cryptocurrencies and the technology behind them. A spokeswoman for the bank confirmed the contents of the memo. The new cryptocurrency team will be led by al Kash Shah, a founding member of the Data and Innovation Strategy Group at Bank of America. Every report to Michael Maras, who leads the bank's global fixed income, currencies, and commodities research. Besides cryptocurrencies, the team will also cover technologies tied to digital currencies. A growing number of investment banks have begun offering or are in the process of offering cryptocurrency services to their clients. They include Goldman Sachs, Morgan Stanley, Citigroup, Standard Chartered, Wells Fargo, and DBS. These financial institutions are doing this because they know something is coming up and they have to prepare for it and find a solution for it. The Reserve Bank of New Zealand will also look at the potential for CBDC to work alongside cash as government-backed money and assesses the issues around the emergence of crypto assets such as stable coins. It says that a central bank digital currency might be a solution to the ongoing reduction in the use of cash and that it will look more closely at the use of cryptocurrencies. The bank will open up public consultations regarding a CBDC and the emergence of new digital forms of money including stable coins. They are also very well aware of the reset and are trying to prepare themselves. Assistant Governor Christian Hawksby said that, the potential for a central bank digital currency to help address some of the downsides of reducing physical cash use and services is something we want to explore for New Zealand. He said, we also know that digital forms of payment are the preferred way of paying for the majority of us and that the future will undoubtedly involve less cash. China's central bank warned that stablecoins, a type of digital currency, pose serious risks to global financial systems while stressing that China's digital yuan doesn't have the problems. Digital currencies issued by private institutions, including stablecoins, have become speculative tools that threaten financial security and social stability and have become used as payments for illegal activities and money laundering. Fan Yifei, deputy governor of the People's Bank of China, said at a press briefly Thursday, Right now, investors primarily use stablecoins as a place to pack money on cryptocurrency exchanges without having to transfer cash back to their bank accounts. As cryptocurrency trading has exploded, so has the use of stablecoins. The total market capitalization of the two largest stablecoins, Tether and USDC, has grown from less than $25 billion to over $100 billion at the end of May. China has taken a tough stance on the cryptocurrency industry, recently renewing its crackdown on crypto mining activity as well as crypto trading most recently shutting down a Beijing-based company for providing cryptocurrency-related services. 
Meanwhile, China is aggressively pushing its central bank digital currency. The country has made 10 million people eligible to participate in its expanding digital yuan trial, Fan said. According to an article on Medium.com, XRP will be the new reserve currency. The amount of public debt owed by the United States government is now more than $22 trillion. This is the highest it has ever been, and as the debt rises, the government continues to spend and tax revenues continue to fall. The level of debt is growing worldwide and is not sustainable. To make things work out, a new reserve currency is needed that will replace the dollar. XRP is perfectly positioned to serve as a world reserve currency. It can be held in significant quantities to provide liquidity for foreign exchange reserves, international transactions and investments, and all other uses throughout a global economy. It was designed for $10,000 because they knew in the future this digital currency will be used worldwide by each and every individual. It will solve the debt crisis without devaluing fiat currencies. Major financial institutions could also stock up on XRP at extremely attractive prices. When all systems, policies, and agreements are in place, they simply announce that XRP will serve as a reserve currency. Ripple partners also know that XRP will be the reserve currency and it will replace the US dollar. That is the reason why we see new partnerships every day. The IMF and the World Bank have been so positive about Ripple Labs, XRapid, and XRP. Even the World Economic Forum has said that XRP will be the global reserve currency. Ripple's XRP price rally has been one of the most amazing rallies ever, as the price seems to experience a constant fluctuation without being stagnant for more time. As the entire crypto space gained enough bullish momentum since the beginning of 2021, many assets have fallen to their knees now. Moreover, many maintain a stagnant trend without much volatility. Yet the XRP price, despite multiple rejections, kept on attempting to jump higher. The price chart indicates tough competition among the bulls and the bears throughout the rally. And hence, the volatility with the price was also considerably high, no matter the price pumps or dumps. In the present scenario, XRP price underwent extreme selling pressure since the early trading hours. In fact, the plunge was expected to revisit the local lows around 60 cents. Yet the price regained momentum and initiated an uptrend. Interestingly, the trade volume jumped from just 2% to more than 14% in just a couple of minutes, registering more than $2.3 billion. The inducted liquidity uplifted the price above 63 cent levels, making a strong uptrend. Currently, the need of the hour is to smash the strong resistance levels around 66 cents and maintain it in order to form higher highs, or else the plunge could be more drastic, which could drag the XRP price below 50 cents. Therefore, a sustained uptrend could boost the Ripple price rally and could also hit $1 in the coming months. On the 4-hour chart, we see the Ripple price action pushing lower today after falling to reach a higher high earlier this week. Looking at the Ripple price action development over the past weeks, we can see that bulls took over control after a huge decline to the 50 cent mark was seen in June. From there, XRP USD started rallying with a clear higher high set around the 73 cent mark. According to the coin market cap, at the time of writing, the XRP price today is 63 cents USD with a 24-hour trading volume of $2.4 billion USD. XRP is up 3.65% in the last 24 hours. The current coin market cap ranking is number 6, with a live market cap of $29 billion USD. It has a circulating supply of 46 billion XRP coins and a maximum supply of 100 billion XRP coins. So guys, this is it for today's video. I hope it could be a big help to you. What do you think about the global monetary reset? Share your views in the comments down below. Don't forget to click the bell icon and participate in the giveaway. And thanks for watching.